Hey, welcome back to Taste of Asia at home. Uh, I bet all my subscribers thought that something happened to me, like I passed away or something, but I'm still here. And uh, today when I was uh, shopping at Publix, I found a, a whole yellowtail snapper. And uh, I thought I'd come back and show you all how to make this dish. What I'm gonna, how I'm going to make it a uh, steamed yellowtail snapper with black bean sauce. And uh, so I'm gonna pause the, the camera and then I'll be right with you. Okay, now you see uh, on the chopping board, I have a, a half of a white onion and a half of a red pepper and I have a big chunk of uh, fresh ginger. And in the background there, I have a bag with some uh, cut up green scallions and I have the uh, jar of black bean and garlic sauce. And I have uh, sesame oil and in the back over there, I have some soy sauce, thin soy sauce. So the red pepper and the white onion are mainly to for a, uh, so you have a base to lay the, the whole fish on when we steam it. So now let's let's get together and we're going to make the uh, the sauce that's going to go on top of the fish and also the underlayment for the fish. What I'm going to do here is I'm going to just take my cleaver and peel this ginger. Doesn't have to be perfect because we're going to use a, a chunk of this ginger to chop up and then we're going to cut some slivers to go on top. So what I'll do is I'll take the end off, then I'll put the side of my knife on the chopping board and smash it down with my palm of my hand and chop it up. That'll go in this little white. sauce cup that I have here. Okay, next I'll take a slight a chunk of that ginger. I can trim it up some more. And then what I'm gonna do is cut it as thin as I can. I like to take my time with this so I can get it really thin, almost paper thin. What I'll do is I'll julienne the ginger. Now the pepper and the onion, you don't have to be careful with that because you're just going to make a a bed to lay the fish on. See what I have here? You can, and this will be edible after we uh, finish uh, steaming the fish because it's going to take about 15 to 20 minutes depending on the size of your fish. Okay, let's get the snapper. Very fresh. I always check the eyes. The eyes are nice and clear. You can tell it's a nice fresh fish. I'll take this one last fin off. And I already cut the tail off so it'll fit on it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to score this uh, yellowtail snapper a few times. And then I'm going to lay it on the, on the platter. See how that fits just about perfectly. 
Next, I'm going to take a heaping tablespoon. See this? It's a black bean and garlic sauce. One heaping tablespoon of that. Maybe a, another little bit more. Okay. Then what I'll do is I'll put sprinkle some green onions in. Okay, I'll measure this for you. How about that? I can use this little bit of ginger to scrape that off. One. Two tablespoons of Kegelman soy sauce. A half a tablespoon of pure sesame oil. And I'll mix that up. Remember we have that ginger in there, right? And what I'm going to do is I'm going to distribute that over top of our snapper and get and getting some in the grooves that I that I sliced in there. The rest I'll just distribute evenly over the fish. As this steams, it's gonna there'll be some juice from this uh, sauce dripping down, which is also good on top of your rice. Uh, and when we're finished steaming it, we will um, garnish it with this um, ginger, julienne ginger, and some more green onions. And then we'll sear it with some hot oil, and, and that'll be done. So stay tuned. We're going to stick this uh, baby in the steamer around dinner time, and you'll see how it comes out. Okay, so now we're back. I steamed the uh, yellowtail snapper for about 22 to 25 minutes. And there you see it. We're going to have to carefully remove it from the... Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this uh, uh, water and the steaming rack and throw it in the sink. And then I'll show you over here. That dries out real quickly. And I'm going to put some oil in this wok. Let it get real hot. While that's getting hot, When the oil gets hot, you'll see it smoking.
See it's smoking? You can see that oil smoking. So I'm gonna you see how pretty the snapper looks. Like with the ginger and the uh, green onion on it. Now watch carefully. You see, I'm searing that go from the head down the body. I can put the uh, oil back on the stove and so it gets hotter if it starts to cool down. And to finish it. And you can finish it off with just a little touch of uh, soy sauce. And there you have it. That's authentic Cantonese steamed fish with black bean sauce. Yellowtail snapper fresh from the Gulf of Mexico. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching and I'm back.